Hello Aries, welcome to my channel Surabhi and in this video we'll see what's going on between you and the person you are dealing with. So on one side will be your energies, on the other side will be the energies of the person you are dealing with and then the most likely outcome and please feel free to swap the characters according to your situation. And for personal readings the details are given in the description box below. So let's see what are your energies Aries. So on your side we have the Ten of Wands. Let's see what's there on your person's side. On your person's side we have the Eight of Cups. The most likely outcome in this situation is the Knight of Swords. So as far as you are concerned Aries, you are feeling burdened because of taking too much load I should say or too much of the relationship, too much, uh, maybe you were, you were the person who were carrying all the responsibilities of um, like uh, moving on with the relationship, sort of carrying it forward, keeping it intact, sort of that. So you were carrying the entire burden of this relationship, be, be it that you were investing too much or whatever you were doing so you were carrying the responsibility and now you feel as if you really want to unburden yourself and somehow what i feel is that you really want someone to support you as far as your person is concerned for the eight of cups this person is definitely somebody here is moving away from you Okay, so this person is moving away from you. Maybe they, this person was emotional for you at some point in time, but now they have really crossed some distance. It's been some time that this person has been away from you or is at least um, on the journey away from you. It's like that emotional aspect is even over. This person has crossed those emotional boundaries and is already moved away. That's what I feel. But the most likely outcome is the Knight of Swords. So somebody here is seen seeing rushing towards you. I don't know whosoever does it, but some it is a very, very impulsive and a very, very fast moving energy. Somebody moving towards you. Let's see what that is. So let's clarify the Ten of uh, Wands on your side, Aries. So for the Ten of Wands, we have the Eight of Swords. The Ten of Swords and the Two of Cups. Okay. So let's see, let's clarify the, there are too many, let's clarify the Eight of Cups on your person's side. Let's clarify the Eight of Cups on your person's side, ladies. For the Eight of Cups, we have the High Priestess, the King of Cups, and the Page of Cups. Okay. So let's clarify the Knight of Swords as the most likely outcome. So for the Knight of Swords, we have the Temperance, the Eight of Wands, and the Justice. So it is what I feel here is that there is something definitely in this connection which you feel that you are really done with. You really can't carry it anymore. Okay, you feel totally knocked down. You feel totally done. You feel as if uh, you really can't take it anymore. You won't be able to deal with it. There is a lot of uh, uh, experience with a lot of baggage here which and that is the baggage which you want to release it from. So maybe this in this relationship there has been certain things because of which you feel that you have the fear of moving forward now towards this person. You have the fear of uh, releasing those uh, experiences and make a move forward. So you feel that you are totally done with it. You want liberation from this relationship. You really want to move out of it. And that is what the burden is. So you want to unburden yourself from this relationship which it, actually it is really a beautiful one. 
actually it is a really beautiful relationship but something has happened in the dynamics which has created all this so this inner fear or it can be some past baggage i don't know but there is something here regarding the baggage of the past experiences between both of you or your own it can be your own baggage from the past which you want which you really need to release actually if you want to keep this relationship beautiful that's what i see it see so either you are wanting to liberate yourself from the carrying the burden of this relationship it can be that also that you can't take it anymore or it can be that you should understand that you need to release unburden your emotional baggage and liberate yourself from it if you want it to turn out beautiful on your person side we have the high priestess the king of cups and the page of cups so here what i feel is that this person is intuitively and spiritually working on themselves they are trying to become emotionally balanced that's what i feel this person is trying to maintain or regain some sort of sort of emotional stability that's what i feel they are moving away from all the emotions which they had and moving away from this whatever it was so what i feel is definitely they do have that emotional baggage they it's not easy for them to move out but they are letting go and intuitively they are trying to balance themselves emotionally balance themselves or control themselves but somehow what i feel is that once they are able to do that maybe this person will make a move because they really have a lot of emotions so once maybe it is just as temporarily temporary going away and once they are able to regain the control maybe they may make an initiative or make a move towards you and that is what is coming up as the most likely outcome with the knight of swords or definitely a rushing in of an energy rushing of a person to and for that we have the temperance the eight of wands and the justice so definitely things will be okay they will be balanced things you will get the justice whatever you've done you will get the the results of that there is a passionate communication also coming in so what i feel is that you will be able to clear clear the air in this situation things will be okay and things will move on pretty fast and pretty uh, in a pretty good manner and in a balanced way that's what i feel so aries that's all i have for you hope it helps and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you and do like subscribe and comment thank you if you like it